Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to another vlog. So I am currently trying to upload a video for my other channel and I'm having some technical difficulties. So I had to move to my desktop. So grateful that I have my laptop to work on and my desktop because like I've had my desktop for years and I finally learned how to like get me a hard drive and not like put too much on my desktop so that it doesn't move too slow. So I've had this thing for years and years and years. My laptop, I just love the flexibility of moving around the house wherever I want to work and I work on that the most. But times like this when it's like acting crazy and I need to move on with the next project, I really love that I still have my desktop. So anyways, I'm trying to upload this video um and get another one edited tonight i'm gonna stay up as late as i can and edit but <laughs> as you can see my hair is a hot mess it was in a twist out i have really been trying to like twist outs and twist outs just aren't my jam my hair like the product i use my hair is really soft like it feels pillowy soft but of course it's a cream so there's no hold and then my hair is just so thin like it's getting thicker but the look of it is thin and the color is fading and so it is not as like full looking as I would like it to be for a twist out so I'm going to put some more um, cream in it and retwist it but I'm going to probably put a little bit of gel on top yeah I have been trying to pick up the camera and vlog all week I am trying to get back into my mode of like my weekly vlog and making sure that I'm posting a weekly vlog, but it is so hard and I miss vlogging because I like just talking to you all and like sharing different things that's going on, sharing products I'm trying, sharing adventures that were going on. And it just seemed like it's been so hard to pick up the camera, but um, I decided to pick it up tonight and I have a couple of things I want to do. Like I didn't do a true fall reset. I haven't even decorated for fall. Like I literally put out my orange blanket and was like, okay, I'm done. Um, because I've been trying to close out projects around the house. So that took precedence. And then I need to clean out my hair stash because I swear there's products in there that I have not touched in forever. And I just want to clean out and start fresh and pull out my creams because I love creams in the fall. Um, and it's starting to finally get cooler. It was a humid day today, which is also why my hair didn't last, but it is starting to get cooler. It's like in the seventies and sixties in the morning. So that's nice. But yeah, I need to clean out my products. I want to finish out some house products and like finally put my fall decor up because I got it down. It's down out of the attic. It's just sitting in the garage doing absolutely nothing. Um, but yeah, that is my plan for tonight. So I'm going to try to get this video uploaded and then I'm going to kind of do my nighttime routine, do my hair while this video is uploading and then start on the next one. I had a dream last night, did everything I never do in real life. I stepped into a room, told everyone. Be quiet, cause I had something to say Blew everybody away Wear whatever I want Dressed in a gown, everybody's like Why are you going nowhere special? Just going to the store I think I'd have it all, tell you why I'd be more Picking the plate, being the plate She is on a rule Never seen her like this Didn't think it existed, no truly Don't get in the way She's not here to play, she'll get moved Take this girl for being me Cause these are dream rules This is someone else I'm not myself, no, no mm -hmm. Cause these are dream rules
good morning friends well it's afternoon so it's been a long saturday already and i have so much left to do so i stopped by starbucks and got me a medicine ball ever since the flag football game i'm telling y'all i've been sneezy and itchy and i try not to take medicine unless i really have to i think i'm gonna get me some um benadryl or allergy medicine when i go to the store today um i need to get groceries stop by my mom's house to do something for her and um just get back home and finish cleaning and doing what i was doing there so this morning i woke up early washed my hair um edited a video it had so many issues with like the files and stuff it took me forever but i got that posted on my second channel um and i was up early thinking that i was gonna have my son so it was gonna take us longer to do what we need to do today and he snuck off with my mom to go see my grandpa so that's two hours away so i was like we about to make the most of this time so i went ahead and got my car washed because it was atrocious um <clears throat> i think i might go back and wash my juke later because it's been sitting outside since there's stuff in the garage so i might do that um but right now i'm about to go to the dollar tree because i want to find like a little medicine thing for my vitamins and then i'm gonna hit up heb sam's run by my mom's house and then that should be it i'm gonna get back home i have one more little mini project i'm working on and it's my planters outside like i bought a bunch of stuff to put in there i just haven't done it so i'm gonna do that finally put out my fall decor and by then baby boy will probably be home so i'll just make us some dinner and we'll call it a night this will probably be the end of the vlog when i do all that honestly because that's a lot in one day and i need to rest and get this together because i have to see tomorrow so Let's, let's get all these errands done, shall we? y'all so happy sunday so i am actually oops you all are crooked i think there we go about to film a curly hair like fall product i don't know what i'm gonna call it um but i am just sharing some of my my favorite products for this time of year and um new some old um and then I need to finish my project that I started yesterday. So, so yesterday I tried to spruce up the porch and fill my planters. And, um, ooh, I'm shiny. I need to fix that before I um, film this. And like I had the wrong size foam to use, the styrofoam. So I take that back. So I'm gonna try to finish it today and finally, finally put out my fall decor. You'll probably won't see it until the next vlog though because I'm tired and I wanna film this video. Um, one other video i think there's like four videos i need to film today but it's not like full out film it's like film pieces that will complete two videos and then um a part of another video sundays are the days we prep so i wash clothes and or i start washing clothes on saturday but i didn't do any of that yesterday so i need to wash clothes pack cole's lunch start meal prepping do this and then Get to doing the stuff that i want to do oh, i need to put some lotion i just washed my hands all right y'all so i did <clears throat> ended up just doing one video and then finishing out one and starting another but the other one i can't do until i like, finish out until tomorrow because it's an analytic update and i tried to do those on mondays like update it the same day if you're interested in like business, entrepreneurship, YouTube growth, all of that, I, that is what I'm doing on my other channel. Um, and so that's what that video was for. And then I also finally finished up a house project video. I have been wanting to do like house projects and fixing up my house for the longest time. And at first I wasn't going to share it. I was just going to do it. And I was like, nope, we're going to share it because there might be somebody else that's like 
like me and you can't really decorate very well like I am terrible at decorating and my house is so very bland as you can see so I want to change that so I did all that now I'm about to start cleaning I pulled my hair up because I'm gonna go outside and finish my planters and I'm gonna also do some fall decorating outside and I might go cut the grass so I went ahead and pulled my hair up and I'll put a cap over it if I mow my grass but in the meantime I'm starting a load of laundry and opening the Sephora package. It's been sitting at the door for like a week now and it's just ridiculous that I've left it there. So I need to open it, take the stuff out of the boxes and throw this box away with these other boxes. Um, so I got the bread hair gel. It says curl capturing gloss. So the only reason I got this right now is one, because it was on sale. Because typically in the fall, I do more creams, maybe a custard, but mostly like leave-ins and creams um, just because my hair gets so dry. But I had wanted to try this when it first came out and it was on sale at Sephora and I was like, this is my chance. This is my chance to get it. So I don't have to open it yet. Once I open it, I'm only gonna have 12 months. So as long as I don't open it yet, I'm good. But it does say that a, this hair gel is a moisture locking protective gel gloss for wet set curls. So moisture is what I'm looking for in the fall. So I still might actually try it, but I don't know what you're supposed to pair it with. That's the only thing. Um, it doesn't say to pair it with anything per se, so I don't know if I need to pair it. My throat is so itchy <clears throat> because I've been outside a lot and I'm about to go back outside. So I took a Benadryl, but it dries me out. Okay, other thing I got. This is a repurchase. Why? Because I left it in the car and it melted. How dumb was that? But it's the Hourglass Volumizing Glossy Balm. I got it in the color Haze. Like I, It was so pretty, y'all when I got it the first time and don't get me wrong I still got the other one but I leave it inside and I like have to scoop it out but if you're curious that's the color and I was like oh no I need that because that is like perfect for fall and so I repurchased that this is like my birthday gift to myself just a late birthday gift because I legit didn't do anything for my birthday and then my actual birthday gift is this I don't even remember what I picked out anymore. Perfect Strokes Universal Volumizing Mascara by Rare Beauty. Um, you know, I never paid attention to like the expiration dates on mascara, but I seen it right here on this one, six months. But yeah, I wanted to try this out. They had some other products for the birthday gift, but I really wasn't interested. And I'm looking for a new mascara because I've been trying out the milk one, but it's not my favorite. Like people have raved over that one. But it's not my, my favorite. Um, and I actually have it on today. But I feel like my eyelashes are just too short for that mascara. Because the, the tip is like really bulky. So anyways, that's the three things I got from Sephora. It's time to do some light cleaning. I need to charge this battery. Um, so I'll probably do that while I go outside. And I'll just show y'all the finished product. Dollar Tree because oh my god I look so crazy the wind is blowing so bad outside I was outside sweeping and I accidentally ran over my outside broom and it was working it had a little dent in it it was working and I think I was sweeping too hard and so it finally bent and this one's bent too oh, sweet Jesus I'm gonna take this one back I probably bent it honestly in the car Anyways, it was bent so bad, it cracked while I was sweeping, and I was like, absolutely not, I need a broom. And so I went and got two of these because I went and got a dustpan for outside, so I don't have to use my inside dustpan because that was driving me crazy, walking around looking for a dustpan. And I like to sweep off my patio and my porch and all the things, and I need this. So this one goes with this. And then I need to repack these bags while I unpack them because some of this stuff is for school. So I already started one bag. I have some bread in here, some jelly, some peanut butter, and some Starbursts for the kids. Um, when they answer questions, they can get Starbursts. But they've been complaining that they're hungry. One little girl has cried and complained every day that she's hungry. So I'm bringing some bread and peanut butter and jelly 
and then if they don't like the lunch, they can just take peanut butter and jelly. Because they give the kids peanut butter and jelly sandwiches, like the Uncrustables for breakfast. Um, and so then, like one of the little girls tries to save it for lunch because she doesn't like the lunch, but then she doesn't eat breakfast and then she's hungry, or she tries to like bring money to buy one, and then she doesn't have money, it's a spiral. So, there we go. And so I also got some sandwich bags for them. Uh, if you ever, this is a public service announcement, if you ever want to get a teacher something, you don't actually need to get her anything, but get things for her classroom, like snacks and candies and tissue. This is all tissue because we have gone through six boxes of tissue already and it's only October. So I got all of that. That's gonna go in my car. Dropping stuff. I cut my finger while I was outside. That is the second time I've cut my finger doing these little projects of decorating. And I'm legit like. <gasps> and then the other reason why I went ahead and just went is because the plants I put out yesterday keep falling. The little pot that they're in is very small and it's very lightweight. And while it's cute in the space and it fits, they keep toppling over. So instead of buying actual pots for them because one is outside and things go missing off of my porch for some reason, like my pillows blew away, my chair started flying down the street, like the wind here is bad. So I decided to just get some cheap little trash cans from Dollar Tree and try this out. I'm going to fill it. I got, I still have extra sand from Cole's birthday party, which is what I filled the other pots with. So I have some sand, I still have some mulch that I'm gonna like use for this. I have some styrofoam to kind of lift it still, leftover styrofoam. And then I got some like rocks, decorative rocks that I can put on top of all of that once I fill it. Um, I was gonna pull rocks out of the yard, but they're like pebbles and I don't like them. Um, so I just got these at the Dollar Tree. Two bags of these. Um, and then, I got this for the washroom. I have one outside, but it literally has the outside broom, um, one of my mops, and something else, and I'm tired of going back and forth, so I'm gonna put one in the laundry room here so my inside broom can have a place to be and my inside mop, like my steamer. I don't know, that might be too, the steamer might be too heavy for that, but at least my broom. I got Cole some more, um, more hangers because I recently bought him a couple of jackets and I realized I use those for his pants and his tops and his jackets and his two pieces and so I've been running out then I saw this in the kids aisle it's moisturizing body foam so he loves to play with paints in different colors and we're trying to teach him colors and right now everything is pink so I like getting these and hold on let me show you and these bath drops but they sell them at the Dollar Tree, but honestly, you can get them cheaper if you just go to Walmart. But if I'm at the Dollar Tree and we're out, I'll grab them there. But you get a big case at Walmart, so they have different colors. So we practice saying our colors every night, even though everything's still pink. And then finger paint. He also has like little crayons. Anything to keep him busy in the tub. And I just quickly grabbed him some bubble bath because apparently he ran out at my mom's house. So I'm gonna pack her bag as well to take to her house. She ran out of what she needed for him. All right, so it is 4.39. I wanna be in the house no later than 5.30. Like I wanna be done with outside no later than 5.30 and I really don't think it's gonna take me that long. Like the first one's always gonna be the hardest. Like with the planters outside, the first one was the hardest and I was trying to figure it out. And then by the time I did the second one, it was really simple. I think y'all are leaning. Anyways, the second one was simple, so I'm thinking these will be pretty quick and then I can finish sweeping off my porch and putting my decor out there because it's all outside. I just have to put it in place. And then we're going to work on the inside. I low-key got like a burst of energy and I don't know where it came from because all I wanted to do when I came home today was go to sleep. I'm so tired. But I got a burst of energy and I want to get everything done this weekend because we'll be gone next weekend. And then I'll be done with projects for a while because, of course, you know, fall decor, Christmas decor. The next big project is my and I still have to get pieces for that. Like I need a dresser. I need end tables. Um, I need new bedding. And so that's going to take a while. So I'm just taking my time to do that. And yeah. 
and I have to figure out what I'm gonna do with the pieces in there. We haven't got any foster care calls, like surprisingly. After I uploaded that video, if you don't know what I'm talking about, I'll link it in the cards. But after I uploaded that video, um, like I had been getting calls every day and I'm like, what's your time frame? When do you need me? Because it was like infants or like uh, babies that were in the NICU. And so I'm like, but when are they coming home? Like, you know what I mean? And anytime I'd ask questions, I never get a response. So I guess I was asking her too many questions, which you should ask lots of questions because the worker's job is to get them in the home. They don't really care how it affects you once they're in your home. Not all of them. Some of them do. But the one I seem to be working with right now, she don't seem to care because she tries to send me like sibling sets of two and three. And I'm like, I have one here already. Like, what am I going to do with four kids all of a sudden? I think, no. So... So ever since then, she has not like contacted me at all. And I had said yes to a baby and I didn't hear anything back. So I haven't taken the crib down yet. Like it's still toddler style. I haven't completely taken it down and taken it out of my room because I feel like as soon as I do, I'm going to get a call, but I really low key want my room back. So we might not be taking a baby. Use a bassinet for a while if we do take a baby and then maybe figure out how to do the bed. The only thing is with foster care. If they're two and under, they prefer them to sleep in the room with you. Um, so that's why the bed's still in my room. Or else I would have put like a smaller bed in Cole's room and like made that like a, a shared room. But anyways, I digress. Let me get outside, finish what I'm doing because I've wasted enough time talking and put all this stuff in the car. Mm -hmm. 